this started really from an advisory board that we had, and I had Dr. Juris come up and really uh, lay out what we do for research and how it goes back into our products and, and education for our own field people. And uh, we showed this advisory board for two days really what we do here at Cybex. And when it was all over, I asked them, what was the most important thing that you saw here? And they said this number one thing was the research and education. How come you're not sharing that with us? The Cybex Research Institute is the research and education arm of the company. In terms of product development, it is essentially our moral compass and making sure that we are doing the right thing and developing products that deliver effective results. In the YMCA, is supposed to be suitable for anyone that's really involved directly, hands-on, fitness prescription. So we get here and we're handed these fairly large binders and um, I thought, okay, we're probably going to go over product and I thought, okay, we could do that. We're here to educate people not only about products, but really about how products are tools to be used in what we call a toolbox so that they become part of an overall programming structure. This was pure research and education. So I think that's what I came away with that I was really excited to be able to bring back here were educational opportunities that were research-based. We're talking about the fundamentals of anatomy, kinesiology, and biomechanics, and applying those fundamentals to really any tool that's on your fitness floor. We're not here to think that Cybex is the only option for us, but we are here to understand that, you know, at least this is my takeaway, was that um, Cybex has put a lot of effort and research into their product, and they're wanting to impart that understanding to the YMCA's that are thinking about purchasing equipment. I think one of the most compelling reasons to participate in this program is that it has the power and affords you the opportunity to fulfill your potential as a fitness professional. Anyone attending the program, first of all, should have an aha moment. Why wasn't I thinking like this before? So we feel like we've done our job when attendees of the product specialist program look at things differently from when they came in. And if that's what they do, then we've been successful. Since I've come back, I've actually started to use this information to train my staff. This would be a great opportunity for you to take a step in that direction and to help you fulfill your potential as a fitness professional. Do it for your staff because they're the ones that need the training even more.